Let's go over kipping knees to chest. For this movement, we're gonna be hanging from the rig. We're gonna be moving through a smooth kipping motion as we pull our knees up as high as we can, ideally to chest level. Remember, during our kipping motion, I'm going to extend my body and then I'm gonna be pulling and tucking in. So we call this hollow and Superman. So I'm going between my hollow and Superman position. My legs should stay straight when they're underneath of me. Let me demonstrate. If you do not have a rig or a bar that is stable enough to kip on, you'll just complete strict knee tucks. That would look like this. We're gonna build your grip endurance here and that core strength. We don't wanna swing. If you don't have the ability to hang from a rig, perfectly fine. We can take this to the ground. You'll just need to be able to hold on to a pole or a stair banister or something that you can brace against. You'll come on the ground with your arms stretched behind you straight. Hands are about a foot off the ground. I'm then going to tuck my knees up and I'll slowly extend my legs straight out in front of me. My left feet will not touch the ground because this will require core engagement. If you do not have something you can hold on to, you can also tuck your hands underneath the edge of your butt, tuck those knees into your chest and slowly bring them out. It's important here that your lower back stays on the ground. You should definitely feel that one burning. That is your kipping knees to chest. 